Good evening, Richard. It's uh, it's James here again. Listen, I'll I'll get straight to the point. Um, I don't know if you've seen anything of that which I'm now referring, but I've seen things, okay? So earlier today, uh, my eyes have seen things I still cannot comprehend. Uh, there are faces in these walls. <clears throat> One face in particular, Richard. I'm not trying to scare you away. Maybe you already know what I speak of, but you haven't said anything in fear of losing your job. I don't know. Sorry to dump all this on you. I've just got a feeling I cannot shake off. A feeling of deep, deep dread. Maybe there's a reason no one has bought this piece of land before Wario did. Thinking about it, I, I don't even know if anyone else than him were ever allowed to buy this land for some reason. I called an old friend of mine, and I, you know, anyway, I, st I started thinking, you know, about what I was seeing and the story about the factory and everything. So I, I called an old friend of mine, a guy who helped Wario set up his first cafe back in the 80s. I got curious to know more, you know. The horrific story from this factory, the things I saw today, the unfortunate set of events in the brand's past. Clearly, there has to be more to Wario than we originally thought, right? So, my friend, he, he told me that he too, in fact, had seen things uh, back in Wario's original cafe. Strange, unexplainable phenomenon. Anomalies. But with the rumors of the factory being cursed, the horrible incident in 2007, and the strange vibe we get from this place, the sightings I had today, the old caverns below this place... You know, one cannot help but make connections. And wonder if something deeper is happening. I don't want you to worry about losing a job, Richard. You can trust me, I too know there is something strange about this factory. It doesn't feel right at all. I'm on my way over to you right now, in fact. I'll take the night shift alongside you tonight, okay? I'll be there very soon. <laughs> Do you ever get that feeling, Richard? Like, uh, um... Like the air feeling off. The wind is haunting. Have I, have I been here before, Richard? Have, have we been here before? This dream... Is this now, Richard? Has this... So it's in this bit now with his yacht. And now with his yacht. And the huge yacht. Yes, the fine ready. Let's see if it's rocky or smattering and all abusive.